Hello students, my name is Sumit Mehta. Today we will cover about what is the area of a sector and what is segment of a circle. In our previous lecture on circles, I discussed about what is the circumference of the circle and what is the total area of a circle. So let me start with area of a sector. So what is a sector? Let me draw first. This is a circle with center O and this is a sector this you can call as minor sector and the rest part of the circle will be called as major sector ok this is called as major and this will be called as minor so how to find the area of a sector if I have to find the area of a minor sector, what I will do, let this minor sector sweeps angle theta at the center of circle, means angle AOB is theta and the total angle of the circle will be 363. So this minor sector only covering is theta and the area of circle as you all know area of circle is pi r square so area of I will say minor sector means this part will be theta the angle covered by this minor sector upon the total angle this is 360 into total area of circle this is the area of minor sector I hope you guys are clear up to now how to find out the area of a minor sector or a sector. The area covered by the sector upon the total, uh, the degree covered by the angle covered by the minor sector to the total degrees means 360 into area of circle. So now you have, if you have to find out the area of major sector will be pi r square minus minor sector area means from the total area of circle you have to find out the area of minor sector area ok I hope you guys are clear up to now let me tell you what is the minor segment and what is major segment of a circle This is called as the covered area. This is called as minor segment. Segment is a part of anything. So we referred here as this as minor segment and the rest area we called as major segment. And there is one more term uh, regarding circles which we called as arc of a circle. Let's suppose this is the radius, this is angle theta and this is minor sector so the length this is A, B this is B this length means the length A, B, B which is a curve in nature is called as minor arc or length of an arc This is called as arc, A R C, arc of a circle. And how to find out the length of an arc? As we all know, the circumference of the circle is circumference is two pi r, and this arc is uh, covering an angle of theta. So theta by three sixty into 2 pi r will be the length of r so this is a very important formula theta by 363 into 2 pi r these two formulas are very important from exam point of view guys please do remember this formulas from your heart 
okay this is the length of the arc formula and this is the area of minor sector or you can say area of sector formula what is the difference between these two if you have to find out the length then there should be the circumference okay 2 pi r and if you have to find out the area then there should be the area of circle this is 2 pi, pi r square and here it is 2 pi r this is the difference let me uh, come to the question part how the question comes on this so students here is the question in which we are given that we have to find out the area of a sector of a circle with radius 4 and angle 30 degree uh, let me draw this is the center and this is the angle 30 degree and the radius is 4 so as I told you previous area of minor sector this is our minor sector well right area of minor sector will be theta by 360 into pi r square so theta is 30 degree we have given that 4 square so means 1 by 12 into 22 by 7 into 4 into 4 4 3 the 88 by 21 so we will get approximately as 4.19 centimeter square okay this is the area of minor sector and he asked us about area of major sector for major sector what you will do is you will do pi r square minus area of this area minus 4.19 so i hope you guys can do it your end you can find out the value of pi r square then from pi r square you will separate the value of area of minor sector which we sold is 4.19 centimeter square let me give you one more typical example that what can be the toughest example from this uh, chapter so let me write this question for you first so students as i told you this is the typical example from this question which examiner might ask you let me draw the diagram and what the question states is a code of a circle let me draw the code this is a code of a circle okay let me say it is a code ab of a circle with center o subtends an angle of 60 degree here so the code is subtending an angle of 60 degree so this is angle 60 degree find the area of the corresponding minor and major arc so the he is asking about the area of minor and the major segments of the circle major segments of circle okay so we have to find the this area first and the rest area can be find out by subtracting it from the total area of the circle so to find out that this area first we have to know we have given that a circle of a, a code of a circle of radius 15 centimeter so the radius of the circle is 15 centimeter and we have to find out first the length of the code then we will find we can find out the area of this figure first to find out the area of the minor segment but what i will do is i will find out the area of the sector by using the sector formula which is theta by 360 into pi r square so this is 60 by 360 i am getting the value of this whole let me give you one this this covered area red is area of sector 1 by 6 into 22 by 7 into 15 into 15 what will be the value this is 3 11 11 into 15 225 11 into 225 by 21 i am writing this as area of sector so i have to split the area of this triangle from this area of sector to find out the area of segment area of segment minor segment which is will be area of sector minus area of triangle OAB 
and to find out the area of triangle OAB I need to find out the length of AB so how to proceed for the length of AB so we are given that in triangle this angle is 60 degree so this angle will be 30 and this also will be 30 and we are given that this so using Pythagoras theorem I can write sin 30 is if it is a b c and this point was o let me assume this point is c I can say that uh, sin 30 will be a c by o a this is perpendicular by hypotenuse this is the formula I told you in my previous lectures about sin 30 okay sin 30 is half so our a c upon radius is 15 hypotenuse is 15 so what we will get AC as 7.5 centimeter so complete AB will be 2 times AC means 15 centimeter now to find out the area of triangle AOB which is half into base is AB and, to, and now if we know the value of C 7.5 we can use directly hypo, uh, Pythagoras theorem let me erase all this first and to find the area of triangle AOB first we need we know the value of base AB and to find out the value of altitude OC what we will do we will apply Pythagoras theorem Pythagoras theorem states that in this triangle OAC, triangle OAC, AO square is equals to OC square plus AC square. So 15 square is equals to OC we have to find out plus 7.5 square. So 15 square is 225 minus 7.5 square will be OC square. Let me write this as this. And if in once we know the value of OC, we can find out the area of triangle AOB, AOAB -O or AOB, which is half into AB into OC. So we know the value of AB is 15 into OC will be root of 225. Just do solve this at your end. Okay. Once you know the value of triangle AOB, you can put this in area of segment formula means area of sector. You can find the area of sector by applying theta by 360 into pi r square minus area of triangle AOB. So to find the area of uh, triangle, let me erase all this for you. So what I will write area of segment will be area of sector minus triangle AOB. So as you know the area of sector will be theta by 360 means into pi r square. As you all know the value of r theta also and area of triangle I told you here. By getting the value of here you can directly find out the value of minor segment. So I am uh, lefting the part of uh, calculation at pure end. So guys please do the calculation at your end and if you still face any issue or any doubt please do comment in the comment section guys. I will be happy to help you guys there. Thank you students. Happy learning.